Oh. Right, he's dokey, let's get this mask off. Flipping hell, fantastic. Bradley from B Rad TV here. Finally in lockdown, been able to get to Wales to see my friend Sean, who is coming towards me. It's Sean. Uh, uh, is that Corona? Yes. Corona. Oh man, what are we doing? What's the plan? What are we up to? We're off to uh, Tesla. Is there a toilet? Yeah, yeah. Do you want to show yeah, yeah, yeah. Should we yeah. Nice quick journey, actually, but I mean, having the mask on was horrible. It is awful, isn't it? Yeah. So I picked us up some barbecue food. I picked us up breakfast. There's a car uh, coming. Which is effectively. Should we get, should we get on the pavement? Shit loads of meat. Shit loads of meat for breakfast. Fantastic. I also got us a bottle of whiskey. Ooh. Not that we have to drink the whole bottle of whiskey. I don't. I, I, <laughs> uh, and I bought two boxes of Peroni as well. Look out! Sean, there's a road. What are you doing? Trip to Cardiff. From Cardiff, Sean's driving us down to Tembe. We're going to the caravan. I did it a year ago. We're doing it again. If this becomes a yearly thing, that'd be hilarious. That'd be amazing. Right. Let's get in the car and go to Tembe for seaside, beachfront, barbecue, beer, whiskey, everything. Hey, can I assume you're sticking something on the car? What? <laughs> So you said, oh, let me just sort something out in the back and then I could hear the squeaking of the metal on the car and I thought... Oh, there's shit all over your car, that's what it was. That wasn't me. <laughs> oh, there's was shit all over it and there's shit here. Oh. Uh, uh. Every time I see you, you look different. But this is like since we've met, like you've gone from long hair down to you looking like a Viking to complete bald. I've seen you like in all states where I've either had some stupid hair or now bald. And I just can't go short enough as far as I'm concerned. I've got two things planned. One of them is tonight, we're going to the cove. You remember the cove? Tonight we're going there. Yep, table Wicked. cooked. Now everything is, you know, track and trace and stuff like that. And now, and now everything's... I didn't even know this whole mask thing was coming on. The mask thing, that's only like like supermarkets and on public transport, that's not in pubs, is it? I don't know. So I went to one restaurant and you had to wear the mask to get to your table and then you could take it off. And the other thing is, tomorrow morning, oh, should I wait until tomorrow morning to tell you? I was intrigued, so Sean has said that there's an act, we're not drinking too much tonight, which he's just basically got to keep me in check because that's what will happen. Um, and so there's an activity booked tomorrow morning and I don't know you know Tembe at all Tembe is on the Welsh coast beautiful sort of picturesque seaside heaven and I'm just racking my brain thinking what activity is there that you can book during corona two grown ass men I've told him that I'm not working out or doing anything like colossally physical at the moment I'm intrigued and I thought like could it be some sort of local wine and cheese thing but I thought who does that in the morning <laughs> me yeah, <laughs> yeah. it's not like, the first time I've been drunk by you can you give me a hint or a clue w will I have to change what I'm wearing yes will I keep my clothes on or will I take the clothes I've got off and put on something someone else is going to give me you'll put on something else someone is going to give you oh fucking hell oh fucking hell what was that am I going to get wet in the the complete bodily sense not the sexual sense in both senses yes I mean, is it actually going to get wet yeah okay is this some sort of water based activity yes I don't have a swimming costume with me you're aware of that right Oh, it's okay, they, they supply stuff, it's fine. They, hang on, Corona, someone's going to give me swimming trunks, which is basically wet underwear. That's why I booked the morning session, so they probably will be damp, but not Corona-filled. I'm, I'm, I'm intrigued, I'm intrigued. Have you not guessed it? Is it wakeboarding, jet skiing? Not jet skiing, jet skiing's for assholes. Swimming? <laughs> Kite surfing, bungee jumping into water, man, look at these two on it, fucking hell. His face is smashed, two cans of Strongbow. Welcome to Cardiff. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, can you guess? No. I'll tell you what, I just need to make a call. Why are you phoning someone? Because I need to speak to them. And also I need the size of what's your size of wetsuit. Good morning, Anthony. Hello there, hi. And I have a lesson booked tomorrow for two male adults. Need wetsuits. Uh, we need one wetsuit, yes. Large, small, medium and large. 
44 chests. I'll go 40, large. 40, 40, yeah, go uh, large. Yeah, Freshwater West, tomorrow. Um, do you know the area? I know the area. Do you know if that van is there, the um, the Cafe Moor? Cafe Moor? Yeah, do you know if that's going to be there tomorrow? And open? Yeah, that'll be there. Yeah. Oh, good, good, good. So we're wearing wetsuits, Alto Refo. Alto Refo. <laughs> It's not For those who speak English. It's not scuba diving, is it? No, it's not scuba diving. What is it? Come on. Surfing. I'm taking you surfing. Surfing? Sean, you're going to embarrass me. I used to be a skateboard and I won't be able to stand up on the fucking thing. What's with this northern thing? Have you been spending too much time with... Northern thing? What northern you, thing? You keep chucking a northern twang in your... No, I don't. I said do. I said fooking as a joke. All right, but you Oh, that's not an intentional thing. <laughs> I, 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 I've not developed a northern accent suddenly. No. It's like, where have you been? No. Oh, uh, yeah, surfing. You're going surfing. I've, I'm, I'm, I'm already two lessons in, and I can stand up and fall off a board within a second. Okay, I think he just wants to humiliate me. I don't, we don't really have a camera there, though, are we? Because there's no. No, I was going to bring my GoPro, but yeah. I, haven't got a, I haven't got a floaty for it. We won't be able to stash it or anything, will we? No. Yeah, and like 44 inch chest. That's my Fat Man T-shirt size I wear. I'm, I'm on baggy T-shirts. It's been so sunny. I haven't noticed. I've had my curtains closed, and I've restarted Red Dead. I was trying to get into um, Twitch. One or two. two. Twitch? Isn't that where you play video games and people watch you? Yeah. Isn't that for like scantily clad women with big boobs to play video games what? and have guys that... send them all their money because they're in love and they think that if they send all the girls money, there was some guy who bought his favourite gamer a $6,000 hot tub. Like yeah, that. so I was just going to go topless and hope for the best. You get a lot of men, I reckon. I'm okay with that. Yeah. If they pay in for my hot tub, that's yes, fine. I keep thinking like, no, no, we're not doing that. I had someone message me on Instagram, do I have OnlyFans? And I was like, no, <laughs> that's not happening. We were going so quickly and we just slowed down. What is this? What is this? It's not a bank holiday, it's... Ride till I can't no more Take my horse to the old town road I'm gonna ride till I can't no more Who's your favourite Batman? Bale Christian Bale? Yeah Ben Affleck All the way If I On could... that note, do you know the area we're going to, Tembe and, and He's Bob Welsh, Bob? I know that, but you don't tell He's me... He's from Harvard West He's from like three miles from where Hannah lives are we going to bump into Christian Bale having a pint? You apparently... Is he going to kick the shit out of me when I tell him Batman's my Ben Affleck's my favourite Batman? Apparently... <laughs> I'm going to change my art style and say he's my favourite Batman. I think if I was going to be a villain of any sort, I think the Riddler would be somewhere, think, somewhere I could go. I think. Can you give us a riddle now? Yeah, I can. I was just thinking of it. Knock, knock. Come in. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you, I'm the Joker. <laughs> um, who's there? Go fuck yourself. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and I'd saw Catch Me If You Can, I thought that line was fucking brilliant. And I was standing around talking, there's a big group of us talking, and one of the guys, he was a team leader at the time, but he thought he was a fucking manager. You know, you got no power. And he walked past and he went, Sean, stop talking. Fucking eight of us stood in a circle talking. Knock, knock. And he went, oh, who's there? And I went, go fuck yourself. And everyone went, ooh! <laughs> yeah, or telling your supervisor at work to go fuck himself or fuck off or do that. Did you get fired? They put me into a meeting. <laughs> <laughs> You've probably seen the, the wet floor signs that have the person slipping over. This is something I saw on the internet that says caution, and the person slipping, they've like stuck a cardboard man that looks like they're kicking, and where it says caution, wet floor, they've put this is Sparta underneath. So it says caution, <laughs> this is Sparta, and then it has the man falling with someone kicking, like he's kicking the guy into the ditch. And I did that, and like it's just that was just in one of the corridors. So I did that thinking it'd be fun. And again, it was just, I think, that afternoon, like, right, like, right after that happened, the, I think, I don't know, the deputy manager, the manager of the day, whatever, was there saying, right, who's done this? This is not acceptable. And I was like, well, that was, that was me. I just thought it'd be funny. And then I got in, like, not serious shit, but they were like, right, realistically, if anything happened, if someone broke their leg or anything, we'd get in huge trouble for not having a wet floor site. So that is like a big no-no. You can't tamper with safety, security, so that. And I'm like, oh. so I, I took that on the chin. Like I shouldn't have done it, but it was funny. I'm, it sure, was funny. I'm sure someone got a giggle out of it. I got a giggle out of it. I got and to top that off, I have got a guitar previously owned by you. Oh dear, the, the fuck King off. Bradley. Yeah, oh, I, used to, I used to think very highly of myself before I got depressed and realised I was a piece of shit. 
and I had to claw my way out of that ditch. And then I became a hippie who does awesome things. But look, just because you're trash doesn't mean you can't do something great. It's garbage can, not garbage cannot. That's, that's not bad. That is not bad, is it? <laughs> <laughs> it's Did you just it's, make that shit up? No, it's my new favourite saying, yeah. It's trash can, not trash cannot. <laughs> I'm like bent in some weird position, holding this on my thumb. I've literally got a sweaty back from it. Ugh. We're literally near there now, aren't we? Yeah, we're nearly there. What the fuck was that? Oh, it's just bumps. Yes, for Captain Wills. So that actually he was hammer. He, um... Oh, Sean. Bradley, Bradley, Ollie. I want you guys to be He video. does this a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Look at Sean with the puffy. He hasn't seen the back of the car. Yeah, we've got to take everything in the house, haven't we? Yeah, we're going to do it. Yeah. Thing. Come on, Sean. Just got to nip over to Hannah's house to get my wetsuits. Oh, okay. Right, so Sean fucked us. We we're meant to be, I thought we were stopping and we were only stopping to see the dog. So now we're driving somewhere else to pick up the wetsuit for surfing tomorrow for him, which is my lovely. Wet, no, my, His my, wetsuit. my wetsuit, yours, you've got to hire yours. Oh man, I just feel gross. I've been on the coach. It's all right, man. We're going, look, we've got a table booked for half five. When we get in, I'll book a taxi. I mean, I hope I'm really sweaty, otherwise I've pissed myself. <laughs> I'm not that sweaty. In my new car. I'm oh, not on the coach, I just got in here, covered in piss. Oh, I'm okay with that. I like heels. Heels are sexy. To wear yourself or on a lovely lady? On a lovely lady. Oh, right, yeah. Leave them on during for added... Well... Yeah, hang on, I was just like joking and doing broad strokes here. I don't want... There's no personal shit like that on the internet, man. That's fucked. The internet is fucked. Sex sells. Yes, yes, it does, yes. But I'm not interested in selling sex. Give it away for free! <laughs> Captain Wales, I've been um, I've been writing, get, just getting ideas. Captain Wales, guys, we've got updates. One year on, we dropped the teaser. Ugh, a bit my tongue. So they're on about mining that. So I was thinking of, he works in a Welsh gold mine. Now in the Captain Clog Eye. Clog Eye, but we're not going to call it Clog Eye for legal reasons. Legal reasons, yep. I was just chew a sneezing there, Corona sneeze, I wasn't. <laughs> Clog eye! <laughs> that's, the, that's what happens yeah, you do that's how the Welsh sneeze. <laughs> I wasn't actually saying any brand of gold if that was one. You have to save with... the world from a super, a super villain that I'm yet to decide who, because I can't have Doctor Doom. And what are we emotionally... I lose to Doctor Doom. And what are we emotionally involved in as well? Has he got like... He's got a love interest who is He's Merlin's daughter. He's got a love daughter. interest, Merlin's daughter. Oh, the guy gave him his powers. Oh, and what's Baron, going on and, there? And this is a woman who at first isn't that, that she, she's interested in but she doesn't show it. The Is there trend. full penetration on screen? No. <laughs> Remember the... So I, I've just, I watched Always Sunny the other day where they're going to make a movie and then the character Dennis just starts saying, right, but what we want, we want more full penetration, right? So we want full penetration, solving crime, back to the house, full penetration, solving crime, more full penetration, full penetration, it, crime, penetration, crime, penetration. It might Those. get as far as the sex scene in uh, Deadpool. Okay. The, the Man, it smells like manure. Countryside manure. I'm glad my sense of smell hasn't come back yet. Fuck off, Sean. You are joking right now. It still hasn't come back. How long have Sean, I, I can't share this with fucking cuddling. Hello, how are you? And you've you've actually got fucking symptoms. We like rewind, go back to ones, everybody. I don't so, have symptoms. I've that got means you fucking got it. I yes, mean, I had it. No, that means you're fucking in the throes of it. No, I'm not. I haven't had the sense of smell, Bradley, for three, four fucking months. That fucking means you've got like the worst strain of COVID I've ever heard of. <laughs> it's just right. No, so it's lingering what on. Funny Bradley. joke you're telling about not having no sense of smell. What a funny COVID related joke you're telling. Ah ha ha ha. You know that's not how COVID works, right? What? Manure? 